guys, it's Michelle. Welcome to my channel. If you are new, if you've been here before, then thanks for coming back again. Um, so I'm just here today to show you another wee wig from Hair Wears Natural Collection and the wig that I want to show you today is called Zinnia. Now the shade that I'm wearing is dark red. This is Zinnia. So for me, this is maybe a wee bit different and it's much shorter than what I often tend to wear. Now, it's a bit of a cute pixie cut, modern, stylish, works for people of all ages, kind of cute wee number that we have going on here. So let's just talk a wee bit about Zinnia for you guys. Okie doke. So Zinnia is another one of these dual fibre blend wigs. It is 70% heat friendly synthetic mixed with 30% human hair. Now that kind of lets you use heat, style it, play around with it and give you the best of both worlds. You have a kind of longer lasting wig than you would maybe have with a standard synthetic and yeah you can just play around and do your thing with this hair. So let's talk a wee bit about lengths and bits and bobs and then yeah I will show you the inside of the cap and we'll talk some more. So the very front type bangs on this is 2.25 inches long here. The crown is 3.75 inches. The sides are 2.25 inches here and the nape is 2 inches long. So, as this has come straight from box, I have literally put it on my head and this is what you are seeing. So, Thanks, my daughter just said I look nice in this. For me, um, what I would probably tend to do with this, I would tend to, if this isn't my wig, I'm reviewing this for Hannah of Hair Wear, who is just a gorgeous woman. And basically, um, <laughs> this is quite versatile, although it's short, with the kind of short pixie cut styles, you know, like you can have it, you could have the front all down if you wanted, if you're quite into the whole heavy, blunt looking front, like so. You can go for this kind of look, which, let me have a wee check in my mirror, yeah, so you could have it all forward like this. I quite like this, I know it's a bit full on for a lot of people maybe wouldn't like this, but for me I do quite like to have a, a heavy fringe sometimes on a shorter wig and I like to have that option. What a lot of people are probably likely to do is sweep this fringe bangs to the side here. And you could, I mean, you could get some wig cream and you could kind of piece it all out and have it all bitty here. I mean, you could have it all spiked up if you want to spike it all up along here. Add some volume to the top if that's your kind of thing. I tend to prefer quite sleek here. I do like it forward, I like it to the sides. Now I'm going to turn and just kind of let you have a wee quick look at this from different angles. So I'm going to show you it from the left first of all here. And I'll show you the back. And from the right. So, yeah, this is actually a very comfortable wig. And the reason is because we have this gorgeous, gorgeous, incredible cap, which I'm just going to show you. It does come in a whole host of beautiful shades. As we've said, the zinnia here is the dark red that I'm wearing, but it does come in a whole lot of gorgeous shades. Now, if I take this off just now, I can show you the cap, which I think is really beautiful. Now, we have this full monofilament top. There's a polyurethane strip along the front here if you do like to use wig tape or glue. You can adhere it here. Now, what is lovely about this, we have this kind of stretchy, fully hand-tied cap. Now, that is really quite special, and I do love a fully hand-tied cap. I find them cooler, I find them more comfortable. That's my sort of personal preference, but um, yeah, it's really gorgeous, very natural look. Now, with this, we have a velvet nape, and we have Velcro adjusters to tighten this up. This is an average size cap. It is quite generous cap, so I would have it more tightened up for a better fit for me personally. The ear tabs are velvet covered and we have some metal stays inside to allow you to mould that to the shape of your own head. So yeah, that's better. I've tightened that right up and it does feel much better on me now actually that I've tightened it. Um, it is a pretty wig. It's kind of cute and kind of funky. Pixie cuts are definitely very much 
always in style. I think it's a kind of timeless classic. If you like short hair, you know, pixie cuts kind of, they don't really go out of style. They're always, always in style. Always. Just always. Um, it is really cute and you can kind of switch it up how you want to wear it. You can see obviously your scalp shining through here because you have that monofilament top. You can change that parting. As I've said, if you're kind of like me and you like to do things a bit differently, you might like a really heavy blunt fringe like I do and you'd maybe want to wear it down like this just for a wee bit of a change or you can obviously sweep that off to the side. So this is just another wee wig part of the natural collection from Hairwear, another one of the Duo Fiber, which is a combination of heat friendly synthetic with human hair, um, one of these wigs and it's really pretty, comes in a whole host of gorgeous shades. Thanks Hannah for sending me this for the purposes of doing a bit of a review and just a show for everybody. If you're in the market for a pixie cut wig, I would definitely urge you to consider this because it's a beautiful cap. I'm liking the way that all these layers are cut throughout it. It does give a good amount of versatility. If you then start to use a styling product, you can piece out the fringe, you can have it all forward, you can pop it all to the side, you can pop clips in. There are so many things you could do with this wig. I don't want to start adding product to it because it's not my wig to keep and therefore I don't, it wouldn't be fair for me to start adding things into it and then returning it back to Hannah and she'd be like, Michelle, what are you playing at? <laughs> so um, I'm not going to add anything into it, but even as it stands just now, you could see already that, you know, it is a pretty wig even without doing very much to it. And I also think it's important that you guys get a chance to see the hair straight from box because you don't want to see a wig and think, oh, that's beautiful. And then you get it and think, that doesn't look right because you've not put loads of work in so it does let you see how it will look straight from box. If you pop it straight on your head this is the kind of appearance that you're going to get from it um, and you can jazz it right up and personalise it and customise it to your own kind of fancy wee style and look. So yeah, I hope this has been okay for you. Thanks guys for tuning in once again. I look forward to being back with you all very soon for some more wig reviews and until next time, take care of yourself, keep sparkling, don't forget to be your own beautiful and sending you all of my love. Bye guys!